After weathering some controversy, a new beer started rolling off the assembly line today. It's Duquesne Lager, canned as the 409 Paterno Legacy Series, complete with pictures of the former Penn State coach. John Shumway reports the brewery is rushing to meet the demand for the cans. In our neck of the woods, there's a certain career pinnacle you've reached when your likeness rolls off the assembly line on a beer can. But in this case, the honoree has been embroiled in controversy for the last couple of years. Duquesne Brewing came under some criticism for doing this, but owner Mark Dudash says it's just the right thing to do. Very successful his career over 40 years, what he did at State College, what he did as a coach, what he believed, and I just thought it was a natural. Along with his likeness, Joe Paterno's now restored record is embossed on the cans. 409 forever. And the late coach's wife, Sue, and son, Jay, were on hand to see the first cans come off the Duquesne Brewing line in Latrobe. It's fun. It's a, it's a really an interesting moment when I walked in here and saw the cans and saw them running. And uh, it's, it's something that's going to be fun to be involved in and uh, hopefully do some good with it. Part of the proceeds from the beer will go to Paterno Family Charities. And Jay Paterno says progress has been made toward restoring his dad's reputation. But his family's far from satisfied, and he knows some will reject this beer because of the controversy. I don't blame them. I mean, they've been fed, they were fed a narrative that was not true by some people, and it's slowly coming around, and more and more people are starting to understand what really happened. The royal blue and white feeling runs strong in this part of Pennsylvania, and you just know some of these cans are destined unopened for sports memorabilia shelves. Not to mention tailgating parties at Beaver Stadium. I think it'll go over well. A lot of people respect what he did over the years. People in tune in, people in the State College area really love Joe. No matter what happened, they still love Joe. And I they think will they will. The they will buy the beer. Around here, I think it'll go over just fine. They're going to be running this line fast and furious over the next couple of days and ship on Friday. So the beer will be available in the Pittsburgh area distributors probably by Monday, and then we'll all see how well it sells. In Latrobe, John Shumway, KDKA TV News.